I haven't taken him out of the bag yet. I wanted us to both get a chance to look at him for the first time together. So we're going to do that. You, me, and this snake. Hello. Ha! Top of the one offensive family. It's early. I'm getting a new snake today. And before we go get that new snake, I'm going to go for a run because... I just woke up, it's butt crack of dawn, and I think that, it's, that it needs to happen. It hasn't happened for a while, so I'm going to make it happen. Still got my retainers in. I feel like such a nerd right now. Okay, let's just go. Let's go. We got some managed to run. I'm going to do some actual running, then we'll go get that snake. And it'll be fun. Right, Hilo? Oh, good boy, good boy. I, it, it's very dark and cold out here, so I'm going to let you guys hang out while I go run. You see this, the moon setting over there? Isn't that nice? That's nice. I mentioned, I don't even know what snake I'm getting. I don't know what the snake is, but I bet you it's gonna be a burning pile of hotness like that over there. One little tip about how to get up and run early in the morning is do it before you start thinking about it. That's how you end up running with retainers, wearing jeans, and a leather belt on a five mile run. All right, I'm gonna go get cleaned up. Let's, let's get out of here. Oh. These things are crucial, crucial. I went to a Bible study and pickleball without you guys. Sorry, I, it's kind of, Bible study is kind of intimate and then pickleball, just, I wanted to get straight to the snake, okay? And before we look at the snake, I'm gonna tell you the story about this snake. And I said, I don't know what it is. I know what the genetics are on this ball python. I don't know what it looks like yet. And let me tell you how I came to be getting this snake. I don't get new snakes too often. Been on the path of slow growth, for ball pythons here and my projects, it's always been slow. That's the that's the that's the goal is to move slowly and steadily. I got a snake. I don't want to say it was two years ago now. It must have been two seasons ago. Yeah, I got this snake from from Justin from Canova before it was Canova. You guys may remember I did the unboxing in this room of that snake, and I had a lot of people guess, and nobody guessed it right, except for maybe one person who actually guessed it wrong. Technically, if it turns out, so this snake was an Enchi GHI red stripe spot nose clown and when I first got this snake my one question was how do you see GHI in this snake and he said you know just comparing it to other snakes and I, now I want to give breaks where breaks are due when you're producing lots of different snakes and lots of world firsts sometimes all you can do is compare when you get to a certain amount of genes you're playing a kind of a guessing game as far as which ones are in there for sure but I, I said okay if you say there's GHI I'll take your word for it got the snake have bred several clutches with him at this point and uh when i saw justin at the last show in texas i said hey man you know that snake i got for you guys it's no ghi has come out yet and it's been three clutches now so i told him you know it's like they, there's a fourth clutch and there's still no ghi you know if we can work something out you know i'm gonna get another snake for you guys in the future at some point think maybe a discount or something you know since this one didn't end up having ghi it's like yeah no problem we'll figure something out in the future and so what i didn't expect was for him to send me a text message last week and say hey man do you have a kid yet and I said, yeah, 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 we just had him, actually. And he said, okay, you want a snake? And, and I said, uh, sure. He's like, I just want to send you the snake for free. And I was like, Whoa, okay, great. And, and big props to Justin and the whole Canova crew. For his, such great folks over there. And it's just a testament to how they do business and just want to take care of the folks that, that do business with them. I was not expecting to be sent a free snake. That's not at all what I was expecting. I was expecting to get a snake sometime in the future, maybe get a little percentage off. But instead, I got this free snake. And kudos to them, again, because, you know, you, you get a couple years into a project, and it's like you, you're set back if, you know, what you thought was in the snake. What doesn't, doesn't end up being in the snake, It does. there's nothing that can replace the time. But 
again, you know, I think I've said everything I need to say. I think that we need to take a look at this snake now. Okay, so what we have here is going to be, well, let's look at it first. Let's look at it first. I know I mentioned that we're going to be doing some kind of shipping video, but it turns out I'm not shipping out any animals till next week. So we'll, we'll go through the whole red line process um, of shipping. Oh, oh my goodness, guys. Ooh, this boy's, this boy's like ready to breed now. <laughs> wow. Holy poop heads. Okay. All right. So, oh my goodness, dude, this snake is like ready to breed now. That's, that's amazing. Um, so, yeah, you know, I'm going to wait till next season, but wow. So what we're looking at here is a red stripe yellow belly ghi stranger 100 percent het clown and whoo the cool thing is you know it's got the ghi it's got the red stripe that i had from the original male and actually when i first was talking to him about getting that first snake from him i wanted there to be yellow belly but there wasn't anything that had yellow belly so i kind of settled for um not having yellow belly and and that was okay because I had some females with yellow belly, but now this guy has the yellow belly I was looking for and the GHI. And Stranger is something I've wanted to get into for a while. And it's definitely been on my radar. Um, especially since, since some of my, my good friends work with it. You know, Jason Amos, great guy, works with Stranger. Um, Megan over at Double M or her new... What is, what, what, is, what is Megan's new company name? Gear, gearbox reptiles? I can't remember Megan, sorry, D but Double M. Megan from Double M. Uh, Megan Thays. 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 I always get it right and then I get it wrong right after. Anyway, check out this snake, dude. That is a... That is a gorgeous looking ball python right there. And the animals he's going to produce are going to be bonkers. Absolutely bonkers. Whew! All right. Big thank you to Justin and the whole Canova crew for being awesome. And uh, shoot, guys, I think I'm out of here. You guys want to see the baby first? All right, let's, let's see the baby. Hey, baby got you. Oh, baby brothers. Baby brothers. Don't be sad. Baby brothers. Don't be sad. Baby brothers. Say hello, baby brothers. Say hello, baby brothers. Hey, don't be sad. Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday. Oh, it's not your birthday. Don't be sad. Baby brothers. Say hello. <laughs> He's a hungry guy. He wants to eat something. What do you think about this? <gasps> Who's that? Who's that, baby brothers? Who's that, baby brothers? Who's that there? Who? Who's this? Who's this, baby brothers? Who's that? Who's that? Oh, he's upset. Oh, no. Oh, it's okay, baby brothers. Don't be sad. Everything's okay. I got you. I got you, bud. Oh, okay. Okay, let's get out of here. You guys take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. We'll see you in the next video. He's trying to eat my face. <laughs> Baby brothers. <laughs> let's go get mommy. How about that? <laughs>